That was your meeting? What did y'all talk about? Whatever you wanted to talk about. Business. Well, clearly nothing was accomplished. B I D N E S Z Z. Everything. Like what? We about to do a, a bunch of big things. Why'd okay, you sell Raycon? I'll continue to watch. What's, What's going on? That's his headphone. Right? Right? Seventy-five million your, your after glasses. you already picked up two hundred million. Yeah. Why not? It has was to, that it, the game plan? Well, it was well when you put your full focus into something, it, it's successful. And so where we're going, and I felt like where my old company was going. I would have had to do a lot more work. And then I, this dream of mine, could, it wouldn't exist because it, it's a timing thing. Right now, OTT is still in its early stages, so we can still create our own brand and control a certain number and, and percentage of the marketplace. That's, mm. that's possible. That's an arm's reach. Eventually, it wouldn't be. So I had to make this move. It was, it was important. Luckily, we all saw eye to eye, and, and, um, and now we can, we can both continue to do big things. The plan was always to build it up and then exit. It. Well, it's always the plan to build the company five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten 10 years, and then partner with somebody uh -huh. to help the company go to heights that you couldn't take it without their expertise or right. without the extra funding. Absolutely. That's the plan. It's always the plan. So you might be the biggest headphones entrepreneur in the culture since Dr. Dre. Well, it's different with Dre. It's different with everybody in the industry than us. We don't We've never had somebody that already was big or already had something going in this genre help us. Mm. We've never had help from anybody in the entertainment business that has power. Mm. Most people that are extremely successful or makes money is usually connected with somebody that's at the highest level of a record label or a television. So your company. shit was more... And we did it for the, it's for the mud. From the mud, really? You you owned one hundred percent of it to start? No, no, no. It's not it's not about owning. I had I had one partner, okay. and then we brought in one huge marketer that helped us. So one, two, three, bang. Right. But 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 you don't know them. So if I say something to somebody that somebody in the industry might have felt disrespected about, they can call somebody and cut your deals off. Right. Because they're connected in this situation. They have nobody knows who my partners are. You don't mm -hmm. know anything about the earbud business and structure, nor how to build a company this way, because this is way harder. Mm. And it takes a lot more Ray. patience. You know what I'm saying? Ray, listen. You know, we go back to when we was moving from Wilshire to Tarzana, right? Yes. Um, to the day, right? To us doing shit. To where we was in control, but we really wasn't in control. So, Tron is kicked off. We partner in that. Nobody can't stop that but you, right? Now watch this. But then we have a product. We got incredible diapers over here. Oh, right. Hold on. There's no turning it off because nobody knows who my partners is because I own 100. percent Exactly. Now here goes the great part of number one diaper in the Congo. Now think. <laughs> That's a I fact. love you. What was we said? I love you. You know what? You, you like underestimating. How am I underestimating? I'm hyping you up. But, but, I'm your hype but man. Again, to be underestimated, you don't not. We want that. To be overestimated means that they're planning. They're triple teaming you. They're quadrupling you. Let me, let me, let me, let me show They're ready for you. They've let planned for you. That. They've studied you. Big in here. And as you can see behind me are our incredible diapers. Yes, it is incredible. And we are excited and looking forward to bringing our incredible diapers to the DRC. Uh, so we can show some love and, you know, help with the quality of life for so many families. And, of course, establishing our manufacturing facility out there uh, is our first steps in our economic development and empowerment going down in the Congo. It's incredible. Wow. Shut your punk ass up. Sounds you know like he had a gun to his head. And, and, Shut your punk and, and, and what's crazy up. is that. <laughs> no, shot, no, but look, look, shout out, you see that? And shout out to Nick Cannon. He's also somebody who is Yo, underestimated. Oh, right. And, oh, right. And under they like to celebrate. To not, like, what's up, bro? What? You think I've been lying is about Is that a my, word? I think I just made up another no, word. No, I believe you that you're working with Under celebrated. That's a word. <laughs> Over. Uh -huh. un underestimated and under celebrated. Are you talking about him or you? No, I'm just talking That's about me. people that are doing a lot of things that people don't know. Mm. Because sometimes it's good to just be on the low with, with some of the things, and you continue to do kind of what you want them to see you do. Right. Because you— That keeps you in control. You and I both have the experience of making money off of your identity and your image. 
But as a person who does that, you also are aware of the limitations of that, and it makes you kind of want to like step into marketplaces like you with the headphone thing, where it's not so much about you, or at least at some point, yeah. it completely stops being about you. Well, it it's was just ne- about yeah, this product. It was never about me with Raycon. I, I played the ambassador role. But that right? was part of like when people were hyping it up. I remember I did an ad read back in the day, and it was like, oh, this is no, kind of dope. I, yeah, Ray I, J has a headphone company. Yeah, I was, they, we promoted me on certain you know, um, blogs and certain tech sites and just certain things to, to let you know it's my company, but it, I wasn't the face. The, mm-hmm. I don't, you I don't go that crazy. I just don't though. do business like that. I have a, I have a template to, to utilize everybody and every influencer or whoever it is that we're going to choose that fits that target audience. And then we pay them and they convert the dollar. I can't convert the dollar for certain products. You can, you can't call me and have me promote anything. I'd never do it. I've, to, I've never promoted right. somebody's product and you saw me weekly getting a check and I was like, even though I love Rich, but I've never done anything like that because um, I'm just doing other things.